happening today. Senator Tim Kaine will be in Hampton Roads to lead a public forum against offshore drilling in Virginia. Senator Kaine plans to meet with other leaders in our area to express his concerns about the Trump administration's proposal to open up Virginia's waters to drilling. Kaine wants the White House to exempt Virginia from the recent proposal. Rico Bush picks up our coverage from the newsroom to tell us more about the heated battle over offshore drilling in the state. Rico? Well, Katie Don, this morning, Senator Kane will hold a meeting with business and community leaders in Hampton Roads to talk about how the plan could affect the environment, tourism, and naval operations in our area. That meeting will be held at the Hilton Garden Inn at the Ocean Front at 9:30 this morning. Environmentalists and local lawmakers say the drilling policy puts coastal communities at risk. The Trump administration says offshore drilling, though, will help bring new jobs and ener energy independence for the U.S. Last week, the administration dropped Florida from the offshore drilling plan following a request from the Republican governor. This prompted widespread opposition and similar requests from nearly every governor with a coastline. Senator Kane says oil and gas exploration in Hampton Roads would damage communities and the economy. I took a, a strong position against offshore drilling off the coast of Virginia. And I think the president's action is very, very dangerous. We need to do everything we can to make sure that Virginia also is excluded from the offshore drilling proposal of this administration. Now, it's not clear if the administration will make similar decisions for other coastal areas like Virginia, but the administration is getting a lot of blowback here from both parties. And coming up at 530, I'll tell you about where Kane is getting bipartisan support here in Virginia. Live in the newsroom, I'm Rico Bush. It's on your side.